Hey guys. Hey, it's Lindsay and welcome back to my channel. Today I am sitting down here in front of this camera because I have got a bone to pick. My boobs have gotten bigger lately. So I feel like this video could be good for people who have big boobs and want to relate, but also people who don't, just so they could kind of get an understanding from like where we're coming from because so many people just think big boobs, like, oh, it must be so easy to get guys or you look great in all your clothes. No. So here I am today to share the truth with you guys. For funsies, let's uh, do a little thumbs up challenge. If you guys get this to a thousand thumbs up, I will be grateful. Leave me a comment below letting me know what you want me to do. Unless you're all weird and are like, flash your tits on Snapchat. Unless you follow me and then you already know I have. <laughs> Just kidding, but you should follow me anyway. Yay! And without further ado, let's get into the problems. Let's first start off with fashion. I hate that in Los Angeles, I can never wear a bandeau or anything strapless. Some days I'm really digging the whole cool hipster vibe. Like, I want to be cool and look stylish. So desperately would I love to wear a little bandeau, oversized tank top with like a mug of coffee. Be all like, oh yes, I'm just reading this important literature. What's up? It's like my style is chosen for me. Next up, dating. You never know if a guy is talking to you just because of your boobs. Because there's no way to hide them. You could be wearing a t-shirt, a sweatshirt. If you have big boobs, everyone knows it. I'm constantly wondering if the guys are just looking at me for my boobs. But to be quite frank with you, my entire life I grew up wondering if guys were just interested in me for my boobs. And I hate that. I hate not knowing if a guy is into me for me and my mind and my ambition and my drive or if they're just in it for my body because that is probably the worst feeling in the world. <sighs> Getting real. Another issue I have encountered in my life is back problems. I have scoliosis and when I was little I actually had to wear a back brace to bed that came right under my boobs and then just encased my entire body. Every night I just ripped it off. It was like a retainer. What's the freaking point? It comes out of my mouth in my sleep anyways. I don't know. So in conclusion I wish I had a boyfriend who was also my personal masseuse. That would be nice. And lastly, I'm going to talk about exercise. For the last couple of weeks, I've been going to the gym and working out at the gym because running outside hurts my legs and then I stop working out for a while and then I'm like, I can't lose weight. I'm like, oh, I hate my life. Every time I work out, I feel like I am having a heart attack. My boobs are just against my chest and it's like so painful. So now I switched from the treadmill to this like other machine. That this is life. But honestly, like having big boobs is great. Hashtag blessed. It does kind of mess with you psychologically and physically. Boobs are awesome. Any size is awesome. I hope that you could relate or at least appreciate these facts. If you're new and you liked what you saw, it'd be awesome if you could subscribe. If you want to support me, you could give this video a thumbs up. And yeah, I love you guys so much. And if you want to hang out with me more, you should follow me on my social media. I do a lot of Snapchat. Leave me a comment down below letting me know what you love most about your body. And I will see you next week. See you next week. Okay, bye.